You know what that means. Time to change your setups. Everybody talks about the October lull, but I'm here to tell you, there's no such thing as an October lull. What you're experiencing, first of October, lots of stuff happens. You've been watching these bucks in their bachelor groups and the alfalfa fields and the bean fields, you know, those these ag fields. But what happened in October, the, the alfalfa starts to dry up, the beans start to dry up, but most importantly, acorns start falling. You've got to move to the acorns. The deer are still on their feet in daylight. They have to move every four or five hours in order for their digestive system to work right. So they are on their feet. They're just in the woods. Don't be lazy. If you can move to the woods, move to the woods. If you have any oak trees in any of your pastures, move to those oak trees. But before you set up on an oak tree, if you've got multiple oak trees, that is, walk around and just look underneath of the trees to make sure they're dropping first off. Second off, some deer prefer other trees over, like, let's say there's, there's three or four white oaks right here, for instance. One of these white oaks may actually taste sweeter than the other. So they're going to go to whichever oak tree tastes the sweetest first. I know that sounds weird, but it's a fact. So if you walk around in your woods, find your oak trees that are dropping, try to pick the one tree that they're eating the most under and set up on that. If you feed, go to those oaks, start feeding those oaks, and immediately set up a ground blind and or a, a, a stand. Uh, I like to set up my ground blinds and my stands the day I feed. That way, if we do get a shooter buck there, we just can go in and kill him. A lot of people make the mistake of moving their feed around leaving it as soon as the shooter buck shows up they go in more intrusion into their territory and then put the blind up and then put the stand up well that you're taking too many chances on running that mature buck off so when you go in find your oak trees that are dropping find the oak trees the deer prefer go ahead and set up and feed now make sure you check all your game laws in your state and please feed responsibly